I'm going to jump in and get right to it. If your beard gets sweaty, dirty, drool in it, or anything else along those lines, wash your beard. We are all guilty of listening to that rhetoric or the idea of, hey, be careful, don't overwash your beard, or only wash your beard once a week, or whatever other silly rule is out there. I am here to tell you, that is gross. If those things are happening, wash your beard. Any other part of your body that was going to get sweaty, dirty, get drool on it, it's a no-brainer. You're going to wash it as quickly as you can, but for whatever reason, we have this thing ingrained in our brains that we've heard from wherever it came from to not wash your beard. I'm here to also tell you that the cons of not washing your beard greatly outweigh any impact of overwashing your beard or washing your beard every day. If you're sweating, you're getting salt, sodium buildup that's clogging your pores. If it's dirty, the same thing's happening. We know those downsides to having clogged pores, not good at all. This is something that I've talked about on the channel many times. I've mentioned it in videos. I've covered it on live streams, but it's still asked about on a really regular basis. So I wanted to make a video that I can send to people that you guys can share and we can kind of just discuss and break this down, especially for those of you that live an active lifestyle. If you're working out every day and you are getting sweaty, yes, 100% wash your beard just like you would the rest of your body. As long as you are healthy, as long as you are using quality products, products, your beard will be just fine. Trust me on that. Now, speaking of quality products, I do recommend a daily or gentle wash when you're doing this. And a lot of guys kind of get frustrated. They feel like it's not easy to find. Well, is this stripping? Is this gentle? Is this a daily? And my advice is just watch channels that you trust. Just watch channels that you feel like are going to give you a good recommendation. And I have two recommendations for you guys today. Two of these, one is a newer product and one is one that I've talked about for a very long time. Both of these are affiliates, meaning I get a commission, a kickback on sales, but I am not showing these because they're affiliates, a little like sneak behind the curtain. I could pretty much have an affiliate with any beard company. So I'm not showing these again because they are ones. I'm showing you because they are the best and I believe in them that much. And a lot of you have tried them. We'll be able to leave comments down below. And these companies have no idea I'm making this video. They didn't ask me to make this. They didn't tell me to say anything. It just happens to be what I get asked about a lot and I recommend on a regular basis. It's just usually in messages. So the first one is the classic. This is the LCW Liquid Wash from Beard Octane. This is by far my most used wash product in the history of my bearding life. I I love it. It just does its job without overstripping, without damaging your beard. I would be confident using this every single day. It's going to clear my pores out. It's going to clean the hairs, but it's not going to do too much. And it's just great. It lasts forever. The lather is fantastic. LCW from Beard Octane. My discount code with them is DanC10 forever. That's always there. Uh, make sure you scoop this up when you have the ability to. And then another one is a newer one. And this one really caught me off guard and I'm really digging it. And this is by Whiskey and Hardtech. And this is their, let me make sure I get this right. Their solid beard wash bar. This is not soap. There is a difference in making soap and then making a wash bar. Now there's a couple of benefits to this. One is the packaging difference, right? If you're somebody that's all about the planet and all about preserving the ecosystem, this is a better way. You have a bar in here that lasts forever. I still have my original one up in the shower that I actually brought to Disney with me. I had before Disney and I've had after. This is a new one and I haven't had a chance to bust into it, but this is what this looks like here. And this has the pH of a gentle or daily beard wash. And essentially, it lathers like crazy as well. It gets in there and really breaks up the pores and does its job, but it's not that too squeaky clean when you get a bar soap, which I do recommend once a week, once every other week, but this would be for those guys at the gym. This would be for those guys that are drooling at night that need to wash. This is a fantastic option. What you do is you take it and literally just rub it into your beard until you get a good lather going and that's it. I put this, I have like a little shower rack with a, a grate on there. I keep it on there. Uh, sometimes people keep it right in this tin, completely up to you. My discount code with whiskey and hardtack is Dan C and I believe that is for 15% off. So Dan C for whiskey and hardtack, Dan C 10 for beard octane. Those are my two absolute daily go-to gentle washes that I use 
use and I recommend. And for me personally, I don't have the most sweaty, dirty, or active lifestyle. I'm a teacher, I'm a dad, I create content, I'm going to be at some points in my life really picking up the working out and all that stuff that I should be. I'm just not at that moment right now. I love everything that I'm doing, I strike while it's hot. But if it does happen, I'll be honest, there are mornings I wake up and I do have some drool running down my mouth, I'm gonna wash that day. There's days where I've wore my mask a ton from teaching and coaching and my beard just kind of felt suffocated, maybe I've been breathing in some stanky breath all day, I'm gonna wash my beard and this is really beneficial to have the proper products. To end here, there is one thing that I thought of that I know a lot of you are going to ask and comment about. Well, what about conditioner? My advice when you're washing on a regular basis because of an active or dirty, sweaty, drooly lifestyle, I say switch it up. Some days go with only a wash, which is what I did today. Others day, others days, other days go with a wash followed by a conditioner. When you're sweaty, when you're active, I do not recommend going with a co-wash, which is the act of using a conditioner by itself. You need a wash. You need something that is designed to do that job, not to soften, not to smooth it out. You need something to go in there and clean. Now, I have a video that I recommend all the time, and it's titled like Best Beard Wash Rotation. That is what I still follow. With the audible, right, Omaha, Omaha, when I get dirty, when I get sweaty, when I get drooly, I just throw in a wash day. I don't strictly, rigidly stick to that schedule. It's kind of a baseline to build from. It's got a good balance to it, but this is directed for the guys that are trying to wash their beard on a daily basis, but are worried. The guys that are sweaty, that are working out, but are worried, I'm here to put that to bed. Wash your beard. I've probably said that six times if you're playing a drinking game. Hey, cheers to you guys. Thank you for watching today. But please, first, leave your thoughts down below. Leave your experiences down below. And likely, most importantly, leave your questions down below on this topic. Thank you guys one more time. Dancy Bearded, stay bearded, and stay positive.